mean? Does anybody know what Polly means other than a parrot that was named Polly? Polly, what a cracker, Polly, what a cracker. What Polly mean? Actually, it's more than that or less than that. Oh, it could be. Flower. I shouldn't lie to that. Polly. Anybody know what Polly? Polyhedron. Polly guns. Polly. Esther. Polyester. Means many. So polyester is made of many blends. Many blends. So Polly means many. And a gun is shape. So a polygon is a many, many sided shape. It's a many sided shape. Now, must be enclosed. Exactly. It's not a shape if it's not closed. I, mean, I guess it would be what a shape. What is it? <laughs> is it just lines? Shape. Just lines, I guess. Lines. So polygons is many-sided shape. Now, we've already talked about this. This is what? This is a triangle. It has three sides. And we've already decided that a triangle has how many degrees? 180. 180. Oh, yeah. I already know what I was doing. 170. Nobody was answering, so I just did. Good. Good. So, a triangle is a polygon. Guess what else? What do we call this? Don't say rectangle, because that's not what I'm looking for. Quadrilateral. Quadrilateral. The family name. Quadrilateral. Okay, let's say quadrilateral. <laughs> quadrilateral. It is four-sided, and we decided it had how many degrees? 360. There you go. I heard it say four. Why did they have to make that word so long? Because I felt like it. Because they needed to throw it to be a Jackson in every class that would fuss about it. <laughs> no, just that's one. Uh, now, so we've done two, three, and can there be a two-sided shape? No. Probably, no, there's, there's not. Because it can enclose. Trust Somebody's probably going to, to come up with one of Oh, you tried to do it and it wouldn't happen, would it? It's just like lines are fold over a line. Yeah. And circle doesn't have sides. Okay. What would be a five-sided shape? Pentagon. Pentagon. How do you do a pentagon? I can't draw that. It looks like a house. Yeah, it does. I'll just let me do it. I'll draw a house then. I'm going to show you how to tell how many degrees are in each. 180 okay. plus 180 plus no. 180. Mm -mm. Oh, no. It's, it's 360 plus 360. Okay. Nope. I'm going to come back. Don't start. So then I'm going to do a six-sided shape. One, two, three, four, five, six. Huh? I bet that was hard. I don't care what your shape looks like. Just draw six-sided. I do. Oh my goodness, that looks... Mine looks way better. Oh, I nice. actually did it. Me too. Good. Congrats. Thank you. Excellent. You're welcome. You're welcome. It, that looks better. What is it called? Hexagon. 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 And I remember hexagon being a six-sided shape because six is a, a number in the Bible that is marked with the beast. It's talked about the Satan and six, six, six. Six-sided... Witches put a hex on you. I think they they may be connected to maybe Satan. So hexagon. Dang, I don't know how you made me hate a shape. <laughs> You're welcome. I try. And that kids is how Miss Skinner made me hate a singular shape. One shape is hated by all. Hex, hex, hex. So then we're going to do a seven-sided shape. One, two, three, four, 
or uh, looks like a fish. Oh my goodness. What the I don't care what your shape looks like as long as it has seven sides. I'm just going to call it a stop sign. Stop sign is not a seven side. Mm -hmm. You can do like a weird arrow. Yeah, you can do a real, real weird arrow. Yeah, there's a bunch of different ways. Um, what do you call that one? What do you call it? Well, I'm Hep-tagon. Not help, but I say seven's in the Bible. For God put seven in the Bible quite a bit as a good number. Seven days of the week. There's seven is in there a lot. And I say that it's a seven months. Is that an octagon? No. No. Seven sides. So it is a help to God. It is not help. like. But Jesus helps us. I just say it like that. It's a help to Gone. I don't know why I underline that one and none of the others. One side. What is the shape that a stop sign is? We're going to talk about it. Hold up. Octagon and one side shape. Yeah, just like octopus. No. Okay. All right, boys. So we have three, four, five, six, seven. Now, eight-sided shape. Octagon. One, That's the last two, one that I know. One, two, three, oh four, five, six, Funky. seven. Funky. I don't know how to do that. I do not care what your shape looks like. You can draw a stop sign if you want to, but it just has to have eight sides. And eight sided shapes are called octagons. Octagons. Because octopuses have eight sides, octagons have eight, or eight legs. Octonauts, there were eight of them little boogers under the sea. Yes. Mine looks weird and it kind of looks like a fish, but also kind of looks like a gun. They, I mine, don't, mine, you mine, know, it's fine. Fish it's fine. Mine just looks like a mine looks like helmet. weird looking mine looks USA. Like, a like if a. Okay. All right. It doesn't matter. We're going to talk about the ones that look like what you want them to look like. The ones on the wall over there. We're going to talk about those. Just a second. Now I'm going to do a nine sided shape. One, two, three, four. Can you imagine how much of a reject you have to be able to do that? Time. It is a non a gun. Not a nine a gun, but a non a gun. It sort of sounds like it. One, two, three, four. Seven. How do you draw it? Honey, looks like I feel like I've said it six times. I do not care oh. what it looks like. Give me a nine-sided shape. That's right. The biggest reject. <laughs> All right. Dang, someone really thought of a... Uh, hmm. What should we name the nine-sided shape? No, I'm going. I might have to because it's worth All right. My next sided shape is 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, You can make an N. You can make an N. It looks like a crown with a point on the bottom. There you know what a ten-sided shape is. A crown. Half, what is ten years? Decade. So it's going to be a decagon. Because it's got the same prefixes. Non, decade, octo. What's the... I remember in third grade when kids would flex that they knew what a 12-sided shape was. Not. Well, do you know what a 12-sided shape is? No, I don't remember. Well, it's not one that you have to remember, but I am going to give it to you. What about the 11-sided shape is a... Are you ready for this? I'm not going to draw it, but it's a undecagon. It's an undecagon. Wow, what a clever name. <laughs> Meaning it's not a decagon. It's an undecagon. <laughs> Mine looks like a castle with a flag on it. Twelve sides. I just made a messed up in. Twelve sides is. <coughs> do decagon. Oh, yeah. A do decagon. 
That sounds like uh, a dragon, no Deca. Yo, Deca gone. Uh, that sounds like a Roblox name. That sounds like a dinosaur name or something. Do Deca gone. Do Deca gone. Don't let the Do Deca gone breathe. Now you ready? I'm gonna give you 15. I, you cause I don't know 13 or 14, but I know 15. Wait, there. It is Penta Deca gone. Five. He takes five. Oh. I don't even want to. Penta, <laughs> Deca, this is ridiculous. If I have to write Deca, gone, are we getting all the way to the yeah, No, I'm done. I'm gonna call that. That's all I know. That took so long. I'm, 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 not, gonna, I'm not even gonna do the 15. You can draw an M with a 12. Oh, I'm just saying. Okay. Due to your April Fool's joke when you first got in, and us getting started after your quiz. We are run behind, and I'm just going to keep y'all a little bit later after y'all come back from PE, because I want to teach you how to find how many degrees are in a pentagon, and I want to talk to you about a regular pentagon. This, my friend, is a regular pentagon. This is not a regular pentagon. Not a pentagon, excuse me, polygon. I know what you mean. Polygon. And I'm going to explain to you why they are regular, why they're not and how to find the interior degrees inside, okay? You may now go to pee.